stories one example is last year we got a call from himachal uh, one you know local educated person a young fellow he says that there is a problem of pine needles being uh, getting burned in, in forest and causing huge fires and it's a problem for ad- administration to tackle that he says that what about you know if i collect these make it into bale form like tie it out and you know in 4 feet by 4 feet square rectangular bales and can i send it to you for processing into fuel i said yeah we would like to try it out and he collected it and the process that into fuel amazingly that has surpassed any kind of fuel heating value which we done before till you know till last year it it surpasses all kind of fuel you know, perfect values so just to give you an example there are so many opportunities and he was he was also amazed that okay you know this can be processed into fuel and government for government it, it's a headache you know to to what do what do they do if they collect it where do they sell it or you know there's expense to that but if it becomes a clean fuel everybody involved starting from collection uh combining that into bales transportation everybody starts earning out of that and you're using a waste to that yeah stop the forest fires forest. but to go back to what you said about biochar to put it uh, from my understanding to put it very simply biochar is actually a very basic simple form of actually coal because where coal takes c- centuries yeah. to uh, to uh, to form this is making a simple form of coal actually if my understanding in a very short period correct correct technical technical term is called torrefaction but what you do what you're doing is you are just putting that in a process and you know you can do so so we have a torrefaction unit it can produce 500 kg in an hour right so of biochar so so that's you know you, you just mimic it's you know it's it's, it's called biomimicry so you are just mimicking what nature has done over millions of years is just have to learn those things similar thing you know I'll, another uh, example i'll give you is about uh, bamboo right? so there are bamboo forest now as per the new laws you can give the rights to a forest in a controlled way to a community so they can actually start harvest uh, forest in a very controlled way to sustain those communities so bamboo again uh, grow so fast it becomes a nuisance in terms of you know it, so it so government what has done is has changed from a, a tree to a grass now so you can harvest that and again from a fuel perspective it has excellent properties right so it has one of the so there are so many ways to you can use bamboo but fuel is again one of them and char made of bamboo again uh, has a very high value right so so uh, you know all these are very localized examples So we, in fact, yesterday got few consignments of this bamboo cuttings. Can that replace, you know, coal in a boiler? And you know, when we when we are testing it, again the properties are so amazing. And we have, you know, these bamboo forests, I think, spread across all India in, in different different pockets. And you know, southern, northeast, all these are, and even in Punjab, we have this Kandy region where there are so many bamboo forests. So all of this are, you know. natural resources if we just have to see you know how nature has dealt with so many problems uh, and just do a mimicry of that